having to stave off one of the better top side drivers at Motor Mile. The two make contact. Contact Clemens goes around into Butler Morris. A multi-car collision in turn four on the opening circuit. And Tommy Lemons Jr.'s machine has been demolished. And how about Chad Fincham? Fresh off his win in the pit light 125 at Bristol Motor Speedway. His first k and East Series win in just 13 starts. Fincham looking to carry that momentum into Motor Mile Speedway today. Fincham paced the second practice session. Looked to have a very strong car. Couldn't back it up in qualifying. Fincham started eighth. Has already marched inside the top five and looking for more down the back straightaway to the inside of butler pass complete gliding past the o2 through the apex of the corner and fincham is third not enough real estate to make the pass and fincham falls back in line but he is on the assault matt bowling is in trouble fincham is there down the front straightaway back to work on the 83 in turn number one bowling lets the faster machine go out of the exit of turn two Credit Fincham to second. Battle for the lead down the back straightaway. Half calling, separating the top two contenders. Lap traffic, impeding the progress of Lee Pulliam. And Chad Fincham is there, trying to capitalize in turn number one. Looking low out of turn number two, Lee Pulliam. With a rear view mirror full of Chad Fincham. 44 laps in the books. And the battle renewed for first. Fincham stuck up the tailpipes of Lee Pulliam. A bump and run in turn number one. It opens up the door for Fincham down low. Down the back straightaway, it's Fincham with the edge pass complete in turn number three. An impressive move has Fincham out front. Fincham has found speed at the top side of the racetrack. The gap continues to swell. It's 1.3 seconds, a colossal lead over Lee Pulliam. The 0-2 of Butler, Matt Bowling, and Ryan Repco nowhere to be found. It is a two-car race for the top spot. Chad Fincham is putting on a clinic. In his 2016 debut, Chad Fincham is taking the regulars to the woodshed. A blistering pace from the top side of the racetrack. The long way around. The 416th mile oval. Chad Fincham has had a lightning bolt for a race car today. 136 laps are in. He made it work from the bottom. He's making it work from the top. Nobody has anything for the 19 of Fincham. Fresh off his first career win in the k and East Series. Chad Fincham will snare his first career win at Motor Mile Speedway, storming to victory in the Sheila Motor Mile 150. He moved that car up the racetrack another line, and he picked up, I don't know, a tenth or two there. And it was uh, from then on, I, I knew, uh, I tried to run with him just a little bit, and I knew I couldn't stay with him. And third place was so far back, I just started trying to save tires in case we had a restart. But uh, he had the thing hooked up on the high side. I never thought it would have lasted that long. Um, we had a good car. I mean, that's, that's what's so bad. We had a real good car and uh, got wore out. There's an incredible group of guys here to race against, and uh, we've had great success running from different tracks in the southeast, but this has been one on my bucket list to come get, and, I, and I'm so thankful to be sitting here in victory lane. I remember about two years ago, I was sitting up on top of the toter. Uh, we, I had a mechanical failure, and I watched Lee come down here in victory lane, and I said, Man, I want to be that guy so bad.